Welcome back, riders and enthusiasts, to part two of our thrilling YouTube series on the most iconic motorcycles in history. In this episode, we're diving into the captivating stories behind three more legendary machines that have left an indelible mark on the motorcycle world. The Triumph Bonneville, the Ducati 900 Supersport, and the Norton Commando. In case you missed the first part, don't worry, we've got you covered. Just click on the link above and you'll be able to catch up on all the exciting motorcycles we've already explored. But for now, let's rev our engines and jump right into part two of our series. Hello and welcome to the Motorcycle Lifestyle. These motorcycles are not just modes of transportation, they are symbols of freedom, style, and the relentless pursuit of innovation. They have captured the hearts and imaginations of riders across generations, and their legacies continue to inspire and excite to this day. So strap on your helmets and get ready for a ride filled with adventure, design brilliance, and a dash of rebellious spirit. From the smooth, unmistakable lines of the Bonneville, to the raw power of the 900 SS, and the approachable yet formidable nature of the Norton Commando. We have an incredible lineup in store for you. Whether you're a longtime motorcycle aficionado or new to the world of two wheeled wonders, this episode promises to take you on a journey through the stories, innovations, and cultural impact of these iconic motorcycles. Join us as we explore the fascinating history of motorcycles and take a closer look at some of the most iconic models of all time, including the Triumph Bonneville, Ducati 900 Super Sport, and Norton Commando. Come along for the ride and learn what has made these bikes legendary in the world of motorcycling. So grab your handlebars and get ready for an exciting journey. But first, if you haven't watched part one of our series yet, make sure to check it out to catch up on the awe-inspiring stories of the Harley-Davidson XR750, Honda CB750, Honda Super Cub, and Kawasaki Triples. It's not just a motorcycle, it's an icon. A symbol of rebellion, a testament to engineering prowess, and the epitome of cool. From the rebellious streets of Hollywood in the 60s to the retro-inspired garages of the 21st century, the Triumph Bonneville has cemented its status as one of the most iconic motorcycles in history. You see, the story of the Bonneville isn't just about steel, rubber, and a roaring engine. It's a tale that transcends these elements, interweaving threads of innovation, perseverance, and a bit of star-studded charm. Named after the famed Bonneville Salt Flats in Utah, where speed records were shattered and motorcycling history was made, the Bonneville was Triumph's bold declaration to the world that British engineering was second to none. The Bonneville's reputation is built on its signature parallel twin engine. Initially, the engine was a 650cc powerhouse, but it has since evolved into an 865cc beast. The carburetors of the past have given way to fuel injection, but the bike's silhouette, a harmonious blend of classic and modern aesthetics, remains as unmistakable as ever. Then there's the connection to pop culture. When Marlon Brando straddled a Triumph Thunderbird in The Wild One, he didn't just define his character. He also immortalized the Triumph brand as a symbol of cool. A few years later, Steve McQueen, the king of cool himself, would catapult the Bonneville to international fame by famously riding one in The Great Escape. Today, the Bonneville's vintage charm continues to captivate enthusiasts and celebrities alike, from Tom Cruise to Ryan Reynolds, ensuring its status as a cultural icon. And Let's not forget the phoenix-like resilience of the Bonneville. Throughout its history, production of the Bonneville has ceased three times, but each time, like a resilient protagonist in an epic tale, it has returned. Today, the Bonneville is not just surviving, it's thriving, turning heads with its blend of vintage style and modern technology. In the super sport landscape of the 1970s, dominated by Japanese heavyweights, Ducati, an Italian marquee, decided it was time to make its mark. That ambition led to the birth of the Ducati 900 Supersport, 900 SS, a motorcycle that would not only challenge the status quo, but also shape Ducati's legacy in the motorcycle world. To start, the 900 SS was a mechanical marvel. Its 864cc square case engine, so named for its distinctly square cylinder barrels, was the beating heart of this beast. This power plant was more than just an engineering feat. 
It was an art piece, an audible symphony of mechanical precision, a visceral experience that encapsulated the raw passion of Italian motorcycling. It was about more than just power, it was about character. The unique desmodromic valve system provided a uniquely responsive ride, giving the 900SS its thrilling, high-revving performance. The design was nothing short of a masterpiece. A trellis frame cradled the engine, embodying the blend of aesthetics and performance that Ducati is renowned for. The 900SS was dressed with classic spoked wheels that echoed its retro-inspired design, a clear nod to its roots, and a testament to the timeless appeal of classic motorcycling. Its fairing, slender and sleek, was more than just an aerodynamic accessory. It became a visual symbol of the era, an embodiment of speed and sportiness. The launch of the Ducati 900SS wasn't just a product release, it was a statement. It announced Ducati's arrival in the supersport arena, showcasing its capacity to compete against the might of the Japanese motorcycle industry, and compete it did. The 900SS quickly gained a reputation for its potent performance and distinctive style, turning heads on both the road and the racetrack. As we wrap up our journey through the legends of motorcycling, it's only fitting that we conclude with one of the most revolutionary motorcycles of the 20th century, the Norton Commando. This British-born icon rewrote the rules of design and performance, gaining fame not only for its prowess, but also for its surprising approachability, a paradox that gave rise to its moniker, Unapproachable Norton. The Norton Commando was introduced to the world in 1967, a product of the historic British motorcycle manufacturer Norton Motorcycles. At a time when performance and power often took precedence over rideability, the Commando dared to be different. It promised, and indeed delivered, not just a thrilling ride, but also an inviting one. One of the key factors that set the Norton Commando apart was its unique design. The Isolastic System, a groundbreaking anti-vibration technology, was the cornerstone of its design philosophy. This ingenious system virtually eliminated the excessive vibrations that plagued many high-performance motorcycles of the era, providing a smoother, more comfortable ride. But don't let its user-friendly design fool you. Underneath its civilized demeanor, the Commando was a force to be reckoned with. Its powerful 750cc, later 850cc, engine made it a formidable opponent on the racetrack. The Commando's surprising blend of power and approachability took the motorcycling world by storm, winning it the coveted Motorcycle News Machine of the Year award for an unprecedented five consecutive years from 1968 to 1972. Yet it wasn't just the technical brilliance of the Commando that captured the hearts of riders worldwide. Its aesthetic appeal was just as captivating. The classic British design, coupled with its sleek profile and distinct Norton badge, made it a true visual spectacle. Its unmistakable rumble and timeless silhouette have made it an enduring symbol of British motorcycling heritage. And that wraps up our ride through the most iconic motorcycles in history. Each of these machines not only revolutionized the motorcycle industry, but also defined generations of riders and continues to inspire countless motorbike enthusiasts across the globe. From the AMA-dominating Harley-Davidson XR750 to the superb Honda CB750, the globally beloved Honda Super Cub, the thrilling Kawasaki Triple, the ever-cool Triumph Bonneville, the game-changing Ducati 900SS, and the unapproachable yet approachable Norton Commando, these motorcycles have left an indelible mark on our roads and our hearts. If you're a motorcycle enthusiast, I hope this journey stirred some excitement in you. If you're new to the world of motorcycles, Cycles, then welcome to a realm where passion meets the pavement. That's it for this episode. If you enjoyed our ride through motorcycle history, don't forget to throttle that like button. Share this video with your fellow riders and subscribe to The Motorcycle Lifestyle for more epic moto content. We have a ton of fascinating motorcycle journeys ahead, so make sure you stay tuned. Until next time, remember, life is short. Ride more motorcycles.